Well, for me, I mean, I come to producing kind of differently in that I made 11 movies as a director. I think of myself first and foremost as a director, but I always wanted to use my company, 21 Laps, to broaden in the stories that I tell. Um, and I'm not necessarily gonna be able to do all of that uh, as a director, but I wanted, uh, especially in partnership with Dan Levine and Dan Cohen and the rest of our team at 21 Laps, I wanted a broader range of tones um, and it kind of started small with Spectacular Now and has certainly kind of blossomed nicely in the last couple of years uh, with Arrival and Stranger Things and a bunch of other stuff. So for me, it's just incredibly stimulating, gratifying, because it allows me to tell more stories and in, and in broader fashion. I, I think that I, I really kind of crave that variety and that eclecticism because as a director, you know, I was kind of the family comedy guy and, you know, the Night at the Museum franchise is gonna do that and I'm not rejecting the, uh, the label, but, but it can be limiting. And so uh, as a producer, I love that we're doing grounded science fiction and we're doing comedies like Why Him and, you know, just kind of a, a diverse slate. Um, and also as a director, I can do one story every year and a half. As a producer, Obviously, I can be a lot more productive and I can work on several things at the same time and I can also get to know and collaborate with other filmmakers. I think that I never, I think I never quite realized how useful a producer can be, to be honest, because I, I tend to be a little micromanagerial and so on pretty much everything I've directed, I kind of, I assume that it's my job to do everything. Um, so I don't really look to many people for help when I'm directing, but as a producer, my job is to give that help. So whether it's, you know, relatively young and new filmmakers like the Duffer Brothers, or it's Denis Villeneuve, my job is to advocate their vision, get them the tools that they need, protect that vision and that voice, um, and to be that kind of uh, source of advice and feedback and perspective when they need it. So, uh, yeah, producers can be super useful. I didn't know that. I, I, I know it probably, I can't tell if it'll sound obnoxious, but I literally, from the first day of shooting my first short in film school, I had this very clear sense that, oh, this is, this is what I'm supposed to do. Because I'm not really that good at anything else. And I think that my personality would probably come off like too aggressively enthusiastic in most other fields. Um, but in producing and directing, it's a useful trait. So. Yeah, no, I remember feeling that early that, well, this better work out because there is no plan B. Season two is, I mean, we're deep in it. We are deep in it. We literally finished shooting exactly one week ago. Um, and given that everyone knows we come out on Halloween, uh, you can imagine we're in for, for a major intense post-production period.